Okay, guys, this is really what we're working for. Um, this is a plasma drive that is operating off solar energy. And this is how the spacecraft uh, uh, ion propulsion devices work, I believe, except that we have an atmosphere here. And I believe the uh, spacecraft uh, designs use, uh, the latest one is using nitrogen as the gas that they um, turn into a plasma and accelerate with magnets. But uh, I've got this running as a demonstration to show that this can be done on solar energy. That's a big solar panel out there. And yeah, that's a chunk of energy, I know. But it's coming from the sun. And uh, I'm not creating this with a chemical. This is solar. And it's a big panel. It's about a 40-watt panel. I'm really overdriving my system here. And I can only run it for a couple of seconds to show. But I'm putting this in a great big capacitor. It's just driving through the uh, Slayer exciter circuit that puts out RF, and they use a radio frequency or higher to produce the plasma. Now I'm going to connect this here just for a few seconds and watch this spinner that's running on plasma speed up here. Now that's running on plasma. And uh, let me take this little spinner off. I'll show you the plasma jet. This is daylight, so you can't see it very well. But you'll be able to see that plasma jet come out of there, hopefully. See that plasma jet? And that's being generated off solar energy. I'm not producing this with chemistry. And this is how we're going to get to Mars and the outer planets, I'm pretty sure. And this cuts down the travel time because what you can do is you can run this off the energy from the sun and produce propulsion. And that's what uh, I think we're going to need to get out there to the planets and stuff is this kind of thing. And uh, like I say, I'm producing this in uh, Earth's atmosphere. Now, Bob Pochin has put this in a vacuum chamber and evacuated most of the air and this still produces the thrust. So I'm questioning exactly why this is happening. But uh, I've got propulsion from electrical source, and that's solar energy.